What if they find him? I'm sure that they won't. You can relax now, son. It's been taken care of. It's done. How could this have happened anyway? What was William doing there? What would he have been doing with those men? Why would they want me to kill him? Well, son, what if William was involved too, and then something went wrong? They had a disagreement, and they decided to get rid of him. Oh, that's just not possible. I mean, William had been with us for years. He's known Kareem since he was small. Why would he ever do such a thing? For the money? For money. People do anything for money. Anything. What will I say to his wife and to his son? Oh. They're gonna start looking for William at every moment. I'm sure they'll call the police. I'm done, it's over. Make something up. Like what? Want me to do it for you? It's getting late now. Let's head back. Pull yourself together, son. Don't give yourself away. Hey, Dad. Thank you. Yes, yes, Sergeant. I have with me Dr. Nuri Kubinaglu. We're rushing him to the hospital. Yes, Mr. Michael is with me. You're right, sir, but I really didn't know anything about it either. You can talk to him about it later. Yes, the truck is red. Oh, and just so you know, I shot one of the men in the back of the leg. Of course they won't go to the hospital, but if they need to have it looked at, I mean... You have more experience. Okay, sir, I'll see you over at the hospital. Very well. What were you doing there, Mason? You were following me, weren't you? Do you really think you're in any position to question me, Mr. Michael? All I was doing was trying to save my nephew's life. Oh, really, man? So then why didn't you give those men all that counterfeit money? Why are you constantly doing things like this, Mr. Michael? Let's be honest, we're alone now. What was your intention? Was it to save Kareem, or was it to save yourself instead? You're going way too far, Mr. Mason. Do you realize that? I do realize, I do. I'm aware of everything. Don't you worry about it. Ah, oh, God.